You have entered the Plumbing Business Success Zone, teaching entrepreneurs the business of plumbing. This is Potty Talk Live, recorded live on Facebook every week. Type five in the comments to subscribe to the show. And now your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber. Hey, 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 plumbing pros. Welcome to this 118th episode of Potty Talk Live, where we're talking the business of plumbing. Hey, we got a real uh, plumbing businessman uh, with us tonight on this cool cat edition with the emphasis on both business and man. Okay, I can't wait to, uh, to uh, talk with this guy. Hey, mm -hmm. hey, in fact, you may, you may recognize him because mm -hmm. he's, uh, he's been on the show before. He hey, was. the lovely Lord. I'm looking over here to the lovely Lord. Hey, you baby. find out what, what he was on the one, show before 123. here. One, episode 123. Episode 123. Mm -hmm. and, and also he does um, a little, you know, you may have seen him on a little thing we do, oh, five to subscribe. True, yeah. You know. Well, do you want to show that? You right want to do that? Hey, sure. yeah. We use him as a reminder to five to subscribe mm -hmm. or what? Hey there. I'm Patrick Leonard, owner of Plumbing Professionals here in Hoover, Alabama. And you should be watching Potty Talk Live, or you're going to die. <laughs> Seriously, you may not die, but your business will. That's right. Man, he kills that I got, he, he, yeah, he kills that rubber ducky. Well, he just killed his August. That we just we're going we're to talk about that, and that, that's why I hit him up and asked if he would be on Potty Talk Live because mm -hmm. I want him to share this story with you because this is what it's all about. And I just can't wait. Uh, I'm, I'm kind of proud to, to have him back on here. Mm -hmm. I, I'll be a little transparent. He's, he is one of um, our, say, our clients. Mm -hmm. He's one of my clients. He is. So, so I'm proud mm -hmm. of that. Mm -hmm. But what I'm really Thank excited you. about is, is how he handled what happened and what he did and how he approached his August and what mm -hmm. came out of that. Because this on my heart, look, guys, I, I've, been in, I've been in this business 30 years. And I, you started when you were 12. I did. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. You know, my little wagon, I used to pull my little wagon with uh, you know, all my tools, you know, and I do the work around mm -hmm. the neighborhood. But look, I, forever, I and even trying to teach, you saw me as I'd go, I'd be blue in my face, to, mm -hmm. to trying to teach my guys, mm -hmm. you know, about, about business and how they can up their game and right. how, really how to look at the world mm -hmm. and how to look at their lives. Yeah. And quite frankly, this is what attracts me to. This is what I love. I love, I love, we love working with our clients. We do. Okay. Yep. And I'm, and I'm proud of each one of our clients. Um, and yes. I just, not to uh, specifically, I'm holding, you know, Patrick up here. They're all our favorites. They're all, but, but I love how he approached, approached this because it's a great example of what I really want each of you to do. Mm -hmm. he, he's a great example. And I know he'll share his heart and, um, you know, he's humble, um, but also, you know, you know what he did and how he did it. Mm -hmm. um, and, it and I know he, he would say, if he could do it, you can do it too, if you do these things, mm -hmm. you know, and it's just so cool when he did it. I love it. I, mean, I, just love, I just love it as a man. Mm -hmm. It's like watching one of these movies, you know, where they may take our lives, but they won't take our freedom. <laughs> you know, that kind of, you know, those guys, you know what I'm talking about that, that wells up in us? Well, that's mm -hmm. how I felt about what, what Patrick has done mm. uh, and how he, what he faced his August. And mm. so I, I really, um, I'm, you know, I'm looking forward to talking with him Very and having him share a story. So, mm -hmm. all right. Hey, it's good to have yes. you here though. Mm -hmm. So stick around. You're not, you aren't going to want to miss this. If you are a plumbing business owner, mm -hmm. hey, you're in the right spot here. Yep. A Potty Talk Live where we're talking the business mm -hmm. of plumbing. And that's we what are. Patrick's going to be sharing with you. Mm -hmm. Mr. Patrick Leonard. All right. He's mm -hmm. the founder and owner of Professional, always got to get it right. Um, mm -hmm. Plumbing Professionals. Plumbing Professionals. Plumbing professionals. Professionals, okay, mm -hmm. Birmingham, Alabama, mm -hmm. okay, we, and um, we're bringing him on right now. No, 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 no. Oh, hold on, Patrick, okay. hold, hold on, take, take a drink there. But I want to, <laughs> but I just want to have you guys stick around because you don't want to okay. miss it. Hey, and if, also, if you're watching live, type live. I got to get, I got to get all the things in here. If you're watching yeah, live, let us know you're watching live. Type live type in the comments. Live. We'll see you there. Mm -hmm. Look at there. Who all we have here? We got a lot of people on. Adam and Danny right. and Dan Antonelli is in. Hey, Dan Antonelli. All right, Dan. Nick Ball, Dana Busby. Okay. Big D. Big D's in the house. Oh, so, all right. You say Dan Antonelli? Dan Antonelli. Kick charge in. Kick charge is in. In fact, there. I think Patrick. I don't know if I'm. I don't know if I can speak this or not. But I think Patrick's getting ready to do some. Uh, some kick some, charging some, stuff. Some, some is he going to get kick charged? He's going to get kick charged. All right. I think he's uh, he's doing his thing. Love okay, it. Okay. Love it. It's already, he's already looking good. He, he's, mm -hmm. That's what he's all up about. That's game. what I love. It. He's yeah. up in the game. You know, there's so no holding fun. back. You know. Yep. Okay. Let's see. TK's in the house. Lance and TK. Frank. Jenna is watching live. Buddy. Type live in the comments. Hey, if you're watching Chad. the replay, type replay. Let us know you watch the replay. Yes, please. And if you're listening to my, you know, the podcast mm -hmm. here, I gotta gotta acknowledge my podcast listeners. You know what to do. Keep Just on. keep on listening. Yeah. All right. Okay. 
It just wouldn't be a show for me without Kelly Ball in the house. Kelly Ball's in the mm -hmm. house. All right. So, good to yes, see you. Yes, and John Graham. Hey, John. Good to see you. All and right. And SDP Plumbing. They're, uh, yeah. All right. Good. Um, I always forget. Dre Cut. That's what I there want to go. say. There we go. There we go. Yep. Good to so, have you here. Yeah. All right. And Dan Antonelli saying, yeah, baby. He's getting kick charged. He's getting kick charged. All right. Okay. Super we'll, excited. We'll be looking forward to see that design. I know. Okay. That will be fun. I, I, I warned Patrick, hey, you could be a little, you know, dealing with the little artsy guy. <laughs> you know, the artsy crew there, all they're, they're all artists over there. They're the best. Mm -hmm. But you're dealing with, you know, when you're dealing with artistes, artiste. you know, they, they get a little moody. <laughs> Dan's <laughs> okay. going to love to hear Dan's that. Gonna, I don't think that Well, I'm going to be at the, the service case. expo. I think he's going to oh, be at the Dan? service expo. He's probably going to smack me upside the head when he sees me you know but that's okay because i'll show you an rt <laughs> right, right, right it comes out amazing well, right oh so man it's great right yeah, love love it every one of our clients have, have used uh, kick charge to mm -hmm. have, love here's one of them have. patrick all patrick right patrick Singa. all right Works bbp plumbing. all right hey hey abp i told uh <laughs> share with uh patrick here that you and he you know you're taking each other on which i love a little bit of competition yeah, the two patrick's doing a little the bit two, of competition two patrick's are going after one another mm -hmm. hey that's good competition is good competition all right is very good that's what keeps you alive mm -hmm. okay <laughs> so what do we have what damn it you're still sore about your rebrand <laughs> yeah that's right, that's right. look at Got those it's little so artsy. We're never going to get over that. Those little artsy fartsy guys <laughs> mess with my buddy. I know. Right? Killed made buddy. It, made it Addy Baby. Add a baby. Add a baby. <laughs> baby. <laughs> right. <laughs> uh, but we're going to see Dan Antonelli actually out in Vegas. Yeah. Right? At the, at the Service World Expo. Service Kick World. Charge yep. will be there. Kick and, Charge um, will be there. Um, uh, Sky Boss. Sky Boss will be out there. Trenchless. Trenchless Marketing yeah. will be there. Way fun. If you're not um, going to be there, you're missing out. What? If you're yeah, I've got to be there. Okay, we'll be there. Mm -hmm. Million Dollar Plumber will be there. Lovely Laura. Mm -hmm. CF the Plumbing Sales Coach is going to be there. Totally going to be there. All right, come on out and join us. Mm -hmm. All right, we'll have a good time. So, okay. All right. Hey, right now, yes. I have something for you, though. Oh, we're going to do that. All right. Oh, sure. Okay. Got here something go. for you here. Check hey, it out. Hey, Plumbing Pro, are you struggling to win with your plumbing business? My Million Dollar Plumber Playbook. How to win the plumbing business game. It details all the right moves you gotta make to be a successful plumbing entrepreneur and ultimately a plumbing business champion. In this free 10 video e-course, I share with you my game winning strategies that took me from one truck rookie to multi-truck, multi-million dollar plumbing business hall of famer. Click the link below and grab your free playbook e-course now and get your game on. That's right, click the link. All right, and get your game on. Decide to get your game on. All the right moves you gotta make to have a successful, self-sustaining, and profitable plumbing business all right down there in my free Million Dollar Plumber Playbook 10 video e-course. And did I mention that it's free? I think okay. you did. Simply type free in the comments mm -hmm. or go to themilliondollarplumber.com mm -hmm. forward slash free uh, to get your free playbook now, all right? Yeah. I know Patrick Leonard, mm -hmm. Patrick already knows the right moves. Hey, okay. and um, Works Plumbing is saying they're going to be all at right. the... You're, all right, you're going to um, be there. Service we'll be hanging out Dan, with them. Dan is saying he's got a class on thir Thursday in, in disruptive, disruptive Branding. branding. at Service Expo. Oh, that'd be okay. good. You guys got to check that out. Oh, for sure. Okay, from, from Dan the Brand Man himself, <laughs> okay? <laughs> all right. He loves his nicknames, I'm sure. <laughs> I'm gonna be right. careful. He's he's a biker and all that. He can mm -hmm. probably nah. He can bike all over me. Okay. <laughs> you can take him on. All right. I know, Dandy, you wear those cute little tights and stuff and the hat, <laughs> the you hat, know, the little sure helmet, he you know, on the bike. <laughs> Sorry. Why are you doing this to Dan? I don't know. He said I'm nothing a, to you. I'm just in a mood. I know. You are in a mood. Well, he's he's <laughs> way up there in Canada. What is he gonna do? He's not in Canada. Yeah. He's, no, he's not. Dan, you're not where? in Canada. Where are you at? I thought he was in Jersey or something. No, I think that's just one of his offices. Okay, I don't know. Yeah. I have no idea. Dan, we have no idea where you are. <laughs> okay. Anyway, we're ready to get on with the show. We're having fun. Mr. Let's, get, let's get Patrick on. Let's do it. Mr. Patrick Leonard, how you doing, brother? Hey, hey, what's going on? All right, hey. <laughs> we're just in a crazy mood, man. I know you're in, we're, we're in a crazy do mood. We're in a crazy mood. I think I just got, I just, we ate a bunch of carbs, I think. We that's just, right. We just had a burritos or whatever <laughs> yeah dan all 145 pounds uh -huh. well you're you know you're a you're a cyclist and he is in new jersey right. i was right so okay that's right hey, and patrick's a yeah. marathoner patrick is a marathoner is a marathoner that's right so didn't you just do an 8k or a 5k or something yeah yeah i just did an 8k this past weekend so huh. it's kind of just kind of in the process of getting ready for a marathon all right Dang. man just five kids. Steps along the way. Five five kids. Runs yeah. a plumbing kids. business. Owns a plumbing business. And he's going to be in a marathon. Uh, a marathon. He's, yeah, he's oh, got yeah, a, he's a coach. Too. Right. 
coaching the kids. Who's your junior VP? Next to you there. Yeah, who's oh, the junior VP yes. sitting to your right? We can't see him or her. Yes. I'm not sure. Oh. There, there we are. go. All right. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> yeah, that, uh, that's my son, Isaiah. Um, hey, Isaiah. He's hey, 10. Isaiah. He's 10. Uh, during the summer, he got to go on some calls with us or with me and do a little work, do some dig work. All right. Nice. That's right. Train him young. Put the VP to work. Mm -hmm. All right. Got to start out the bottom. <laughs> well, good, man. Hey, well, I've been looking forward to having it. Thanks for taking the time to be on, Patrick. And as I, you know, as you've heard in the intro or whatever, it's just, uh, I'm just so excited. Um, you, you, you have been on before, and so we, we got to know about your, you know, if you want to hear about, uh, you know, Patrick's uh, business and about, more about him and, mm -hmm. and uh, you know, those kinds of things, you can go back and check out episode, what was it, 126? 123. 123, 123. okay. Mm -hmm. But what I'm really excited about or just really jazzed about mm -hmm. is that, you know, how, what you did with your August, Jody. okay? Now, let me, can I just set this up a little bit? It, sure, I'm a little up, transparent yeah. here that, that, that you're one of my, one of my coaching, my private coaching clients, mm -hmm. okay? So I know a little, you know, kind of what, you know, it was transitioning through some things. And I had a conversation, we had a conversation going into August, like I did with a lot of our, you know, our clients and uh, facing August, because August is normally um, a, a downtime in, mm -hmm. in plumbing. And, and so it can be quiet and, you know, and why, why you, you know, you're building and doing some things. We just wanted to give a heads up on what may, what may be happening. But you didn't take it as a downtime. What did you do? What did you decide to do? No, so I, I took it more as a challenge. Uh, basically, <clears throat> I, I saw it as, hey, whoa, uh, I had set a target and I was just like moving along and thinking targets you know we got the target and we're just going to keep moving forward then i had the conversation with you and i was like oh well like this is an obstacle i like i didn't plan for so uh i got with some of my team and said hey look this tends to be a down month so uh i don't want to miss these numbers so here's what we're going to do we're going to figure out a way to um Let's just say we need about an extra fit. We, we figured out we needed about an extra 15 to 20 calls. Mm -hmm. And so let's go ahead and bump up what the number, what the target is for the month. So, and, and push for that target. So we bumped it up like an extra $25,000 for the month, <laughs> uh, past, past the target we already had set Wow. and said, okay, here's the new target that we're looking that we're aiming at and what that we're going to shoot for if we miss that target and, and we fall short then then we still exceed what the original target was mm -hmm. uh, and so we, you know we, we came up with uh, just an idea to to just start boosting to get some calls and just going so what the, so let, let me and on those you know Patrick uh, if you don't mind me saying you, you're not a tin truck company right so it's not like when you say yep. I was raising twenty five thousand dollars, and these are this is service, okay? Right, sir, yeah, and Patrick's in the business right. is is coming from um, you know building new construction, commercial, some big big transitioning, you know, front, transitioning right. mm -hmm. into more secure service, the residential service area, mm -hmm. but it's a transition. So you've been going you know through all this, and and so really your service crew, um, you know the service, you know, what you have what two two or three service trucks or. So we yeah, we've got um, so we've got two full time service trucks, and then one of because we still are, we are still in transition, we still do some construction. Yep. So we've got another truck that does construction, and then we'll pull him over to do some service. So we'll say like two and a half trucks. Right. Mm -hmm. So with this, you're wow. doing yeah, two and a half trucks. Hey, okay. Nothing. So keep that in mind. That's what I love. So you know, it's so easy to say, well, yeah, it's a you know. 15 truck company and of course they were <laughs> coming out of that no so you're going in actually and i'm being a little little which we all we, we're all there and, and through, going through this as we're going through transition um you know it, of course the transition is going perfectly smooth right everything in this transition is just no hiccups whatsoever. no hiccups whatsoever right and so no problems uh, hiccups all along the way but, right right <laughs> So the same kind of, you know, and you're being, it's able to laugh at them like now, hey, um, but there's a reality that just life doesn't run smooth and business doesn't run smooth. Mm -hmm. And even when you're doing, um, you know, transitioning and working with, with great people, um, you know, and great vendors, 
things just don't run smooth, mm -hmm. right? It's just, just stuff happens, okay? And of course, there's life. So keep in mind, that's why I, lo that's why I love this. I want to build this up because, you know, Patrick, you, know, you have a family, and, you know, we all have families and the concern, and, you know, five kids and school stuff and, you know, just life and that kind of Sports. stuff. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. And so now we're here, we're going into August and things are going to slower, mm -hmm. are going to get slower. <laughs> and so what I love is what you did, instead of just curling up in the fetal position or just saying, <laughs> I just knew it, the man's out to get me and it's just how it is. <laughs> you decided mm -hmm. to not only hit your goal, we're going to raise, we're going to raise the goal to get caught up from the from the month that we were coming out of, right. that, that we didn't perform as well, we, you know, that kind of a thing. So how'd you lead, yeah, how'd you lead your team through that, yeah. Patrick? So hey, first team. off, uh, I will say that the, te the team that we've got is a, is a great team. Uh, and it did not, like, it, <clears throat> we didn't just get them, we didn't just acquire it overnight. It has been a process, a process, a process, a process. Mm -hmm. And the other seven months of the year, we've been building some processes. Mm -hmm. uh, in March, mm -hmm. we started a different process, or April, March or April, we started a different process. And we've been working through that and, and tweaking it and tweaking it and tweaking it. Um, just, and, and when August hit, you know, we've, we've refined it enough mm -hmm. where the process was running a, a lot smoother so mm -hmm. uh, that then coupled with you know the guys that we've got and then uh, me just sitting down and saying hey look mm -hmm. this is uh, so I'm aware that this is going to be typically a slow month here's what we, you know here's what we want to do and when I when I start you know, when we got to the end of the month and look I mean according to like any paid advertisement it was still a slow month like it was slower than July. Yep. So it definitely wasn't like we just had something that was inside of our advertising that was kicking more than, than mm. everybody else. It wasn't. Uh, mm. it, was, it was literally the mindset that we went into August, the steps that we took uh, as August started, and um, it, uh, it, it sprang some calls, which then led to some other ones. And, I mean, just it's, it, it grew. So... Mm. The extra 15 to 20 calls, oh yeah, mm. oh, man. we got that. And, that's, mm -hmm. and what, what I love is the position, really what I, what I heard in there is, is number one, you know, you decided, right. decided mm -hmm. that yeah. I'm going to attack this month. Mm -hmm. Decide. you got to decide. You can't, you, you can't go in and say, well, oh well, or I think we will, or, or I'm maybe just going to batten down the hatches. Or and, bat, right, and mm -hmm. just weather the storm, you know, mm -hmm. we're all going to die. So I might as well try to die the slowest. You know, I, I go off on that kind <laughs> of stuff. So that's, what I, that's what I love about that. Mm -hmm. and, and sadly, so many um, plumbing businesses do that. Right. Okay. Um, when, when things get a little tough or get into something, it's like, oh. And, and part of it's because we've been conditioned that way. Mm. Um, but I love that, uh, you know, that you decided. And guys, um, yeah, if you, you can decide too. It is that, it is that simple. Mm. It's not easy. Could it take some? I and mean, then you, you probably right. had to be intentional throughout the month, right, right. Patrick? Well, that's the leadership, oh. and you had to lead, right? Yeah. yeah. And yeah, and, I, and I'll say, like, the the last week of July was not some stellar week either. Mm -hmm. I mean, mm -hmm. it, uh, and we had a great July. We had a great July, uh, and then the last week, it was actually just all in all, it wasn't. As far as numbers go, it wasn't that great. Hmm. It was pretty low. And then we had spots inside of August where where it dipped down. But we still we still kept pushing. We yep. still kept doing, we still kept working the system and um, still kept you know and, and just trust the process that, that we had put in play and uh, kept pushing. Hmm. And that's it. And that's that's what I love. You, you mentioned the process again, which I appreciate because there is some reality. That's the training for as a sports analogy. The, putting the pro, having a process in place is the training. So, mm -hmm. Patrick, you've been training. You know, you, you, you're a runner. You know, if you, if you go out and run a marathon without having built up for it, you, you're gonna die. You're gonna cry. You're gonna, you're gonna die. <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna, die. <laughs> you're gonna <laughs> you know? be like that rubber ducky. <laughs> right, right, you're gonna die. Right. Well, it's the same with your plumbing business. So you, you got So he'd been putting the systems in place. Okay. So the the um, you know he he had hit the workouts in. Okay. 
So you know, he, he had the, the, the business had the body to be able to step up with them when the mind said, get back up. You know, we love, I love, you know, Patrick, we watch the movies. You know, you're a guy, and I, I, you imagine you feel these things, and, you know, it's like the Rocky stuff, you know, the 14th round of, you know, the, you know, the first, uh, you know, first Rocky fight, you know, when he's, he's getting beat, you know, and he, but he gets back up, and then he calls <laughs> Apollo on, you know, come on, let's go. Mm -hmm. That is, you know, and don't we, as men, you feel that well up, up, up in us, okay? Mm -hmm. And I know we do, even though we, or, we, no, men we have been know Oprahized, that. you know, okay, and we're, we're being feminized, and are, are we men or not men, I'm, yeah, and all that kind of stuff, <laughs> but we do feel that, well, your business needs that, and that's what I love, that's mm -hmm. what I love being associated with, with uh, men like Patrick here, mm -hmm. um, it's, my, it's my blessing that, that, that we get to work together, <laughs> uh, I saw Larry Enright, that's why I love, you know, men like uh, Larry Enright, <laughs> Um, you, you know, come from the trenches. He would speak the same way that, you know, you got to get back up even when the, the, the round goes down. I love that you said that, that you meant it to that. You had days in August where there was, you know, it was probably not very little, you know, but, but did you fold up your tent and go home, take your ball and go home? You know, heck no, no, heck no. Kept, kept at it. Right. I love it, man. What were some of the things that you no, said to your team? Grabbed a new ball. <laughs> right, right. You grabbed a new ball, right. So that's a good, that's a good question. Yes. Patrick, what, what, was some, what did you say to your guys? You know, to your we, team, to, to, to keep to your them team. going through, through August. Because we, we talk about this, and we kind of allude to this even on, on Potty Talk Live here, how the men aren't you. There's a reason why you're the plumbing business owner. Okay, so you've got to lead. Mm -hmm. What were motivate. some of the things that you said to your, to your men to kind of keep them focused and mm -hmm. pushed? Well, um, so one thing is, is that um, I think just leading into August and talking to the guys and uh, talking to them about what we're doing and, and what's going on, being more of a, a more, that more of a process to where, um, and talking to them about, look, man, when the waves, waves hit, like we need to ride the wave, mm -hmm. right? We don't need to jump ship. We need to keep riding the wave. The wave's going to come back down. It's not just going to keep just wait. So we got to ride the wave and then it'll come back down. And, um, so I talked to them a, a lot about that. Mm -hmm. And again, I've got, like, I've got some really good guys and, uh, they want to, get out there and make it happen. So when, when the waves came, they, they rode the waves, mm -hmm. they rode the waves, they got it done. I mean, they were, they were, they were pretty stellar. I mean, they, and they, That's and they awesome. were key yeah. inside of making this happen. Mm -hmm. So like there were times and we, and look, we didn't do any on call stuff. This was not Saturday, Sunday. We did no Saturday, Sunday yeah. work. Wow. I didn't mean, right. I didn't mean, right. <laughs> this was, this was Monday through Friday mm -hmm. and so, I mean, the guys on several occasions through August, they worked till eight. And there was a couple of times, I think they worked till nine or 10 because we, we sold a job in the afternoon, mm. like three o'clock, oh. four o'clock in the, in the afternoon. And we got all the materials and we did the job and we completed the job. As long as the homeowner That's was cool with us getting them, them taken care of then, which nine out of 10 times, they're good with that. Um, yep. They they went out there and they made it happen. Mm. Yep. That's key because a lot of guys will do that three o'clock job and they'll just sell it for the next day and then they've just lost capacity. So, yes, that's, that is key. Yep. Mm -hmm. So how does so uh, coming out of how does this set you up for the rest of the year? What what has this done for you? Or or I think you mentioned the word momentum mm -hmm. in there that you wanted to kind of keep. So how, did it set you up? Yes. Yeah, so you, you did reach your goal. You mm -hmm. did you did achieve that that higher goal. So yep. my so my idea was was that hey listen if August is if August tends to be a down month if we can really make something happen inside of August that isn't typical then then what then we should be able to come out of August with our snowballing already with momentum mm -hmm. moving instead of just kind of flatlining through August and then trying to build the momentum right so uh the rest of the year tends to momentum tends to build throughout the year. So if, uh, September, October, November. So if we come out, if we build the momentum inside of August, then we're going to really be ahead of the game 
Mm. All right. And so mm. I will, we went past that. We exceeded the numbers in August. Well, I've got one of two things we can do. We can kind of chill out and say, all right, well, you know, we can relax. Rest a on bit. your laurels. We, yeah. We, you know, we will, we, we'll, we'll hit, we should hit our target for the quarter or I say, Ooh, no, uh, mm. you know, that's not really the end game. Like mm. we, you know, the end game is a much bigger game by the end of the year. So let's just take advantage of this, grab the momentum and keep going. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, that's how winning is done. That is so, that is so cool. Mm -hmm. So let me ask you then on, how do you feel? I'm gonna try to find the right way to put this because what happens, what you kind of alluded to, a lot of guys will do, um, and I see this, um, and they get into this, this porpoising kind of a thing. They'll have a big month, and then they, they, they back off, and then voom, mm -hmm. you know? So, you know, they, they make, you know, they make some money, supposedly, you know, have a big month, and they back off, right. and again, voom, okay? It's, it's porpoising like that, okay? Mm -hmm. How do you feel um, ener energy-wise or emotionally? You know, you had, you had to get yourself up for August, mm -hmm. so you decided, and you decided. Is it easier now, going into September, to keep that you know, that push, that momentum, that feel, that energy that it takes, or what are you, what are you feeling? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, I'm, I'm thinking, all right, well, like what else do we need to do? Like, <laughs> let's, let's, we need to keep it going. Right. Mm -hmm. You know, what, what else can we come up with? Mm -hmm. You know, all right, all right, well, Hey, you know, come, come, uh, Thanksgiving, we're gonna, you know, what, what can we do for Black Friday? Black Friday month, you know, mm -hmm. you know, Christmas mm -hmm. month, December. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, you know, what can we do just to keep that, you know, and, and what these little things do, or the hope is, is for them to do, is to just fill gaps, right? Just little extra yeah. things that's not, it's, we're not, we can do that isn't, uh, we're not having to spend a ton of money on advertisement that uh, we can do inside of our community mm -hmm. that uh, will just, Fill the gaps, fill the gaps. So when you when you when you start filling the gaps, well, you're gonna have a better month, right? As right. opposed to just having, you know, great gap, great gap, good mm -hmm. gap. Right. Mm -hmm. That's exactly. That's what did you used to say about the buffalo? I mean, I, with my team, my company, I said the buffalo are running. So when the buffalo are running, you know, the Braves we're, we're out until you know till we get the food that we need. The food and the hides need to you know, keep the tribe, <laughs> you know, keep the tribe doing well, okay? Because, <laughs> so, because like, times... you want us to go shoot a buffalo? Right, right. I don't, so, <laughs> I don't so get it. What? My guys would kind of look, you know, <laughs> eyes roll back in their head. But, you know, because the buffalo wasn't always buffalo running. running. But that's just it. It's, you got to fill those gaps. So when the buffalo are running, you know, mm -hmm. Or, or, the, or the trout are migrating, or whatever you want to say, <laughs> whatever you, you want to put it. You got to take you know, advantage. You know, you, mm -hmm. and, that, and that's business, and, and that's how you succeed. Mm -hmm. You know, you don't have to win. Um, you don't have to win every battle or every round, mm -hmm. but you got to be in the fight. Or you got to be in the battle, okay? Mm -hmm. But you keep that momentum going, and that, that's why I just love, love your story, Patrick, mm -hmm. and what you did, because that's... Um, I was wondering if Lance was going to chime in. I'll shoot uh, a buffalo. I'll show, shoot a <laughs> fight. He's in right. Wyoming. <laughs> okay, um, he's, okay, our, um, he's our Wyoming boy. He is a Wyoming boy. Um, Iron Man. Hey, Iron Man. Hey. Um, he's got a question. Yes. What do you do? So, what do you do as far as advertising in your area? And that's a great question, mm -hmm. Iron Man. That's what I wanted to ask you, Patrick, because I have some insight. I I know that your PPC. You were doing some advertising, which the yep. PPC went. I mean, it didn't do anything for you at that in your time. Area, yeah. So you had to. What What did you do? Did you do anything different, or or to kind of? So, um, advertising in my area. So we've done the uh, the Google Guarantee. Yep. Uh, yeah. which is, um, has done really well. Uh, we tried the PPC, but the PPC, the, uh, pay-per-click, um, Google AdWords and it, like, it just did not work. It didn't work in our area, but going into August, one of the things that I did, uh, differently was, was I came up with a, an August back to school special and I started, uh, in mm -hmm. the community. That, that I uh, that I live in, it's a, a Facebook group. Uh, I started by offering it inside of that community. Oh. Um, started there, and then I moved it over into uh, another community that one of my techs lives lives in. And um, 
And then it wasn't till the end of the month I offered it to, I put it on our Facebook, our uh, Plumbing Professionals Facebook, and offered it to everyone. Uh, cool. And that was only like the last 10 days of the month. So you gave special discounting? I mean, that's you gave like a back kind of to school a, special. back to mm -hmm. school, you know, kind of. Yeah, a, but yeah I mean, uh, yeah, six of what I did was, was um, just, I mean, it's no big secret, but uh, I said, all right, look, so I listed out just, uh, just, I gave a quick written up thing, back to school special. Hey, look, you know, we're going into August. I know everyone's. You know, uh, they're, they're tied up with getting school supplies and getting all, nobody wants to think about their plumbing. We understand that. So we want to, we want to serve you as, as best as we can. So we're going to offer you guys a special, like we know you don't want you, like you don't want to have to deal with your plumbing. Uh, so we're going to make it a little easier for you. So if you do have to call us, here's the deal. If, if you're a member, you're going to get 20% off. It doesn't matter. Big, small. Like you spend ten grand, you get two grand off. Mm. Like straight up, there was no cap on it. I put on mm. there, hey, there's no cap on your savings. Um, and uh, if so, if you're a member, you get twenty percent off. If you want to be a member, like all you have to do is sign up that day. Boom, it qualifies you. You now get your twenty percent off. If you're not a member, ten, you automatically get ten percent off. Mm. And and if you refer, you know, refer, you have a friend, you refer it to a friend. And the friend doesn't matter where the friend lives or family member, like as far as it's in our, you know, our service area, they, they get the same option. Mm. All right. So that right. generated some work, some, so that, some sales. Yeah. So that generates some calls. Some calls. Do you get, get some calls out of that? Yes. Oh yeah. Okay. And that was and a Facebook yeah. group, a free Facebook group for your neighborhood. Yeah. And just enough momentum mm -hmm. that, get, that just gets you going. Momentum's a key word. I think mm -hmm. you, you, you've used that word. Uh, a couple times, I think we, we talk talk about that. It, that momentum is, is a key thing. Mm -hmm. It's important to get. You know, you can either get the momentum going good for you. You know, uphill. You know, pull, you know it's kind of pulls you up, compels you up, mm -hmm. or or it can pull you back. Right. You know, mm -hmm. and and sadly, a lot. You know, it is it is our choice. You know, a large. That's that's why I wanted to, uh, Patrick. That you know, I wanted wanted you here to say the choice is made. Decide, mm -hmm. decide. And then, and then lead, lead through the process, right. lead your team through the process. Tell, tell them what, what, what we're going to do and where we're headed and how we're going to do it. And then, of course, you've had That's the training, key. had the systems in mm -hmm. place, you know, so you work the systems, right. you know. And, had the building blocks in pa place, right. been working on that for months. So. Oh, that is so, mm -hmm. I love it, man, I love it. So fun. But good, good stuff there, man. Mm -hmm. Well, before, um, before I let you go, is there, uh, can you give any, uh, share any words of uh, wisdom, whether it's through this experience or just experience at all, whether it's business or personal, um, you know, your what's on your heart? best advice. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, so I'll go back to our conversation at the end of July, about mm -hmm. August. And uh, so I had emotions going on, coming out, you know, within, inside of me um, on kind of what to do. Uh, a little, you know, uh, a little bit of like fear, if you will. Um, mm -hmm. Like, oh, you know, I'm not going to hit my numbers. I'm not going to hit. Uh, and I decided to take the feelings, the emotions that I was having, and use them as fuel, right? Mm -hmm. To fuel for the fire that that I wanted. So, so you can take your emotions and and those all those feelings that are rumbling around, and you. <laughs> have to decide are you going to use those to to fuel the fire that you desire right whatever mm -hmm. whatever it is doesn't matter if it's business family or anything like you can either take those those emotions like they may be negative emotions anger fear whatever and you can either bottle them up and retreat or you can use them as fuel to fuel the fire uh, of what you're wanting hmm. That is great. Take that's fear so and turn it into fuel. Yep. Take your fear. That's it. And that's what it is. We all feel mm -hmm. that. You take your fear and turn it into fuel. Mm -hmm. All right, man. Great advice, guys. Awesome. Great. great. Mm -hmm. And uh, that and power is in you. You know, we all feel the fear. Mm -hmm. You know, I, I admit, you know, um, you know, it's not days, you know, you don't know what you're doing every day. Mm -hmm. I mean, today, I'll, I'll be a little transparent. The million dollar plumber today woke up this morning 
And was I in a good mood or a bad mood? You were a big baby. Oh, I was a big baby. I was a big baby. <laughs> you know, instead of BDB, I was what? I don't know what you were. BB, BBD. Big baby. Big, big baby. <laughs> right, right. You know? And it just, I just wasn't on your game. You're not on your game. Mm -hmm. And we, we got some other stuff that we're working on in the business. And, um, and I just didn't, you know, it wasn't working, you know. And mm -hmm. so you can take that fear. And that's what you got to learn to do. Take that fear. I love it. Take turn the fear fuel. and turn it into fuel. Perfect. And we end in the day mm -hmm. um, really well because we take the fear and mm -hmm. we turn it into fuel. That's right. And that's great advice, did. man. Great love advice. It, Patrick. Listen to Mr. Patrick Leonard. He knows All right. a thing or two. He did it. He does it. know a thing or two. Mm -hmm. A real businessman. That's right. All right. <laughs> All right, brother. Hey, thanks for taking the time again. Hey, thank Good. you, guys. Hey, thanks, uh, thanks to uh, the junior VPs there, too. I think we saw a couple of them sticking their heads in or whatever. It's good to see. All right, man. Take care. All right. Take care, guys. Thanks, guys. All right. All right. Bye. 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 There you go. Patrick Leonard. Patrick Leonard. All right. Plumbing professionals out of Birmingham, Alabama. Birmingham, Alabama. Hey, I hope you got something from that. You, you should. If you yeah. listen, okay? Listen to what was saying, you know. In the case of normal, look, you see the family. Mm -hmm. um, you know, he's a, he's a sharp guy. But he's sharp because he's choosing to be sharp right. and choosing to do the things and deciding and then leading. And, and guys, that, that's all it takes, mm -hmm. okay? Is it going to work out every, you know, every moment perfectly? No. Is he, is he said that you know, there's days and times within August that just wasn't going well. But, but you just got to get back up and you got to right. keep coming. You keep coming. You keep coming. Never you stop. keep coming. Never and stop. you will achieve the success that, that you want, okay, mm -hmm. and the security that you want, and, um, you know, the, 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 um, the wealth, both, you know, financially and time-wise, which mm -hmm. is great, that, that you want for you and your family, okay? Mm -hmm. So there you go. Okay. Keep at it. people loving the show. All right. Good job, Patrick. Hey, and I'd love to help you, okay? Mm -hmm. that's, that's what we're all about here, mm -hmm. and I want to help you Oops. Uh, with oh, our Success I'm Academy. Off the screen. Okay. There, <laughs> there we, we go. go. <laughs> there we go. Oh, I think I'm all right. off, baby. Hey, it, we, we're talking about <laughs> systems, systemizing your plumbing business. You've got to have the right systems in place, and I have it all in there in my Success Academy for you. Everything you need to systemize your plumbing business, from your pricing uh, to your marketing, branding, Okay, um, teaching the business of plumbing. It's that basic. It's all in there. In fact, we had a co we have coaching with it, live coaching. We had a coaching uh, session today. We did. Okay, mm -hmm. and uh, you can check it out now. Take it for a test drive. So there's no risk. Okay, I'm not no looking to handcuff risk. you. No risk. 14 day free trial. Simply type success in the comments, or go to themilliondollarplumber.com forward slash success mm -hmm. to check it out. All right, great stuff there. Hey, go back and listen to what uh, Patrick had to say. Yeah. Okay. You can do it too. All right? So until next time, as always, I want to remind you that you were perfectly and wonderfully created, and you were created to do great things. So as always, plumb like a champion. Thank you for tuning into Potty Talk Live with Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber. If you enjoyed this show, share it now. To catch past episodes and get alerts for new episodes, type 5 in the comment section now. Just do it. And join us again for more tips, techniques, and strategies to help you grow your plumbing business.